When I run a search in Matrix and I go to my results, I may be interested in taking the results from Matrix and exporting them to a spreadsheet. So it's really easy. All you have to do is get your search results, select them. Okay. So I could select them all here. And then down at the very, very bottom, there is an option here for export. And when I click on export down here, once they're selected, uh, you'll see that you have the ability to export them a couple different ways. Uh, but if you're just looking at your results, go ahead and just do the agent single line. Now I'm going to click on export. And this is going to give me a CSV file or a comma separated value file. Most computers already know what kind of program opens up that type of file. And so if I go ahead and open it, it's going to go ahead and send this to Excel. So I'm going to go ahead and just move this over here. So it took my search results and it converted them into a spreadsheet here with the fields that were in my results screen here. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and close out of that. Now you're not stuck with this because you can change uh, your exports if you want to. That's going to be under my matrix and it's going to be under settings. So they bury it for you here. I'm gonna go ahead and click settings and your exports live right here. A lot of times what you need is already there, but maybe you wanna pick and choose which columns you wanna see. So if you go to custom exports, you can go and take your exports here. You can add your own export list if you want to. Okay, so I can go in, I'm gonna go ahead and add an export. And when I do that, I can name it. So let's say testing export one, and I can pick which fields I want to see. So think of this like the columns in order that I wanna customize. I wanna see my results in a certain way in this spreadsheet. So maybe I wanna put in like address, and then I want to put in, let's say, the MLS number. And I can always change this if I want to. There we go, ML number. And uh, maybe we want to put in the price. And maybe I want to put in bedrooms and bathrooms. So I'm going to make this real easy, just a very quick one. But you can customize this however you want. So let's go ahead and put in full baths. And yeah, we'll put in half baths here. Okay. I do recommend to include the column names because you want that labeled at the very, very top. So you could put that here, name or label. Uh, I don't really recommend to mess with the separator here. Just leave it set for a comma. Uh, you can put tab, but you really got to know what you're doing here. I'm just going to keep this easy on you. Make sure you include the column names. So you don't really need to touch the separator here. And I'm going to go ahead and click save. When I do that, it'll be in my list. So these are the lists that I, that I can customize. And when I go to my results again, I'll go ahead and go back to the results here. You will see when I go in and I export, I will now have the ability to export them for what I named here, testing export one. Now, because I went in and I edited this, I can export it. And when I open this one, it's gonna have the fields that I wanted in this specific order here. So you, you can either use what's in there by default, or if you wanna customize it, just remember the setting for this, if you wanna build your own exports, is gonna be under My Matrix, and it is going to be under Settings, and then Exports here. As an added bonus, maybe you just wanna export your listings from Matrix. Maybe you wanna keep track of something, you wanna see your listings. Uh, well, when you go to My Matrix and Listings here, you can look at what a, however you want to filter your listings. So I have the entire list of listings right here. But when I select them here, I can't export them. So what you have to do is convert your listings into search results. So if you look here to the right, there's a little option here where it says click here to run this as a full search, which would then bring in your listings as results. And now when I do this, now I can select them and then I have all my normal MLS tools, one of them being export, and I can export it however I want here. So let's export the single line. And then once again, export gives me the spreadsheet, and now I'm looking at my own results in my own spreadsheet, and I can mark this up and do whatever I want. So good luck, use your exporting tool, and thank you for watching.